Terry in Texas. This is part two. This is Dollar Tree. As you can see, I've gotten a lot of stuff. It's probably been, well, I don't know. If you really watch my videos, whenever I did my last video, probably a month ago that I did a video. So, um, I did Target and Toys R Us. I'll put that up later. Um, Dollar Tree. I'm telling y'all, I've been watching some of y'all's videos. Not a lot, because I get jealous because I can't go get the new stuff. But, um, I found some of the stuff that y'all are finding. I watch, look at a lot of Instagram pictures. I found some of that stuff. And then I found some stuff that I'm not sure if people have posted. So let me go ahead and show you mm, what I got. It's $38.10 of stuff I got. So, okay, let me start here. I don't really know if this is maybe a Texas thing because I've only seen it on one other person's video and that person was in Texas. So couple of my Dollar Trees, things that are open or just, I don't know, discontinued or something like hanging off like this, they tend to mark two for a dollar, sometimes three for a dollar, and then sometimes they'll put them in a basket. Today, this particular one had like this rack with four shelves on it, and the thing was overflowing. Some of the things I would like throw away because it was like, eat, like Christmas candy, but I don't know. I guess they need to try to sell it. So t one of the things I got today that was two for a dollar was the sunglass case. And it's blue. My son has this pair of sunglasses. And when he wants to go out and play, his eyes are super sensitive. And he, he has to wear sunglasses. And uh, we can never find them because he always takes them off and throws them. So I got this. So hopefully this will work for him. And it has a um, handy dandy class or whatever you want to um say it's really tough though i can barely do it so actually i don't even know if yeah i can barely do it so he probably is not going to be able to do it but i could always put a carabiner on there anyways i digress okay some of the other things i found um were these waffle works waffle cookies this is a vanilla cookie flavor and then i found blueberries these are not made by Greenbrier. They are made by Silk City Snacks. These things, well here, it says, a, you can read. These things taste just like, I, I opened these, the other ones are for my son. These taste just like a waffle cone. It says a little bit of sweet. I don't taste any sweet. I just taste a regular waffle cone, but white. Um, you do get a very, very, very subtle hint of vanilla. So, if you like waffle cones, which we actually, because my son and I, his issue is sensory overload and just needs to crunch all the time. We actually eat a lot of crunchy foods, and one of the things I buy regularly are either just ice cream cones or waffle cones, just so we can eat, because neither one of us can have regular ice cream. So... These are an amazing snack, and they are only 120 calories for three uh, for an ounce, which is like 15 pieces. And they're tiny. They're um, but they're good. I'm I'm hoping the blueberry ones will like. I'm hoping you'll like those. So I found these on a random clip strip. These are cookie cutters. Um, these are by the Green Buyer brand. I have various hearts, not a wide heart like this. I have a super huge star um, and a flower. But the reason I bought this is for the circle. Um, I want to use these for shapes and just getting him to trace and like work on pinchmanship. Not necessarily for cookies. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. And they're plastic. So I don't know how well they'll cut. Um, but if we're just tracing them, it shouldn't be a problem. Uh, I got a tumbler because I went through our tumblers and the rubber thing is m just grody on some of them and my son loses the straws. Um, so I just got this pink one, this hot pink one. I don't need anything too big. I just want something to sip. I got and some more of these because we were out. These are, um... These are just for a Swiffer Sweeper. They're not for the mop. Um, Frugal Fun Fabulous did a review recently for the ones for the Swiffer Mop Jet. I don't have that. So these are just for the sweeper. These work wonderful for me. These are wet sweepers. 
They're eight to a pack. They also have the Brillo ones that are eight to a pack. I have tried those, but those are a little bit wider and they don't fit near as well as these do. So I thought eight for a dollar wasn't bad. I finally found these. I've been looking for these for a while. I don't know if it was Art Patron or who. So I've seen a lot of these, but these are just some simple double-sided markers. I thought these would be better for um, my son so he doesn't have so many markers. And then we were with the um, speech therapist the other day, and she had him use a mechanical pencil. I've never tried him to use a mechanical pencil. He wrote the best he's ever written. So I bought some cushy mechanical pencils and then some lead and then his birthday candles. And then I bought some more super glue. And then I bought some of these bugaboos. These are not, also, these are not by Greenbrier. These are by um, Bugaboos, I guess is the name. So I did not realize that these last for seven days. I thought these were just seven hours and then you throw them away. So that's, and they come in a resealable package. So you can keep these. Something I probably haven't found in forever is garlic marinara. I love this stuff. Yes, it's a little thin, but it's fine for us. Picked up two bottles of those. They had a ton of their bonus items still because apparently it was their anniversary. Um, I got three of these small bottles. I don't know what I need them for, but I like the size of them. And three for a dollar was good. I found these really adorable test tubes. Um, I homeschool him, so I thought these would be good for projects for us. I got the red the green and the blue and then I needed some more push pins and yes they have the they had them in the cute little tent the round ma magnetic tins already have tons of those so and you only got like 20 or 30 push pins these you get 120 so um, I finally found this storage section um, selection I they only had each size in the red so that's why I want the red I'm not too fond of the red and I don't have drawers in my house so I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with these yet, but these are so nice that I thought I would buy them and keep them. I got two of the bigger ones, two of those, and then two of the small ones. So, yeah, there's that. My son wanted these nasty, huggable fruit things. Um, this, again, was something two for a dollar because it's missing one. It's just some small plastic um, bowls. Um, I like just putting these for candy or what I have one actually in my bathroom when I take out my hair tie I throw it in there so it's not over the counter and then I use some of these for just random odds and ends I hate buying these but my son convinced me because they have really weird ones at the store because they're like 89 cents at Walmart but this is a Zamboe and this is called a rainmaker I have no clue um snacks again for the dollar of movie those for him these for me I finally found the rolling pin, so I was excited about that. I got this really cool bow bowl. It is a vent top, so you can do that with it. I don't know. It's huge. It's 9.0 9.0 ounces. Microwave, freezer, and BPA free. So I thought that was pretty cool. Maybe rice or something. We needed some more of these. I went with this brand because there was 30 compared to 20. These are just for us grilling. And then they also had these in the bonus size. These 360 dusters, you got three dusters. Um, I have a Swiffer version of this that I use. I don't need the handle, but um, that was pretty cool. And then, um, yeah, I think that's it. The only other thing is the Wubble. I found a tiny Wubble. They had two. Um, they were considered Easter um, theme because one was Easter chick yellow and one was Robin's egg blue. I got him a tiny Wubble. We had a bigger wobble and it didn't last but maybe two days and I never send it off because it's like $8 to send it off to get it repaired and I'm like no whatever. So I just got him a tiny wobble again for his birthday. Um, so yeah that was my Dollar Tree. I was super excited about some of these things. There's just a ton of new kitchen stuff and cleaning stuff and toys. There's tons of new toys and just summer stuff galore. So go check out your Dollar Tree. You just never know what you're going to find. And I will talk to you later. Go get you some waffle cookies. Bye.